All right, well, it's day five in the zombie apocalypse, and not gonna lie, we've just been home. All we do is shoot zombies out of the windows and stay protected. But now we have an issue. The issue is we're running out of supplies, so we have to actually go outside, and obviously, it's not safe out there. There's zombies everywhere, but we gotta do what we gotta do. I'm asking my friend. I said, are you ready? And he said, yes. <laughs> All righty, let's get out of here. Make sure you're on point, by the way. Now, guys, you may just think it's not that hard, right? You see a zombie? Zombie, you shoot it. Well, the problem is we have limited ammo. You only have so many bullets. And not only that, if you shoot a zombie, other zombies hear it and they'll start running toward you. And as you can see, there's two zombies right there. Oh my goodness, bro. Yeah, just keep driving. Just keep driving. And look at Brookhaven. It's just so run down. And oh gosh, another zombie. Get away, you stupid zombie. All right, I'll drive around a little bit. Anyways, like I was saying, Brookhaven is unfortunately very run down. The streets are all dirty. There's cracks in them. The zombies are getting to every Everybody. Unfortunately, people I used to know have actually been infected, and they're probably running around now. Anyways, the grocery store was mainly looted, so I think it's empty, but we're gonna head to the mall. Maybe there's supplies here. And Kendra said, let's go in. Uh, wait. Let me make sure it's clear first. Back up. All right, uh, looks clear over here, over there, and oh gosh, I knew it. Two zombies right there, and oh, they're moving. Let's take the back entrance. Follow me. Oh my goodness, bro. These dang zombies. They never leave you alone. They know nothing but kill and infect i'm telling you anyways uh we made it around the back here we are perfect now the zombies are still right there we should get upstairs that's where all the food is okay run for the upstairs here we go three two one let's move we're up okay we're good we're good we're good we're good oh thank the lord and whoa who is this guy he said back off i'm gonna say no you back off who are you and bro there's zombies moving around wait move there's more zombies and he said who are you i'm gonna say i'm tap i'm a survivor and you are Derek, um, okay. Survivor as well. I'm gonna say, so it seems we're on the same side. Let's put our guns down. No need for this. He said, you're right. All right, good. Glad we cleared that up. He said, have you been attacked? I'm gonna say, well, yes. The zombies tried breaking into my house. He said, bites? I'm gonna say, no, I wasn't bitten. And yeah, Ken said, none of us were bitten. Did you get bitten? He said, still no bites. I'm gonna say, so why are you out here all alone? Shouldn't you be with someone for for extra safety? He said, I don't need someone for safety. I can handle myself. All right, I like the confidence. He said, I got a bunker in the middle of the farm. Safe and no zombies can interfere or break in. Walls made of steel. Oh gosh. I'm gonna say, well, not gonna lie. That sounds safer than our situation. He said, even if someone tries to break in, I can end him easily. I'm gonna say, why don't we all stick together then? I said, you do know that would help our chances of surviving. And he said, and how can I trust you? I'm gonna say, bro, we're on this same side. I'm not a zombie. He said, you could just end me and steal all my stuff. Yeah, we could have killed you. We do have two guns, like Ken said. All right, put the guns down. Guns down. He said, I got a gun as well. I'm gonna say, perfect. So you know we won't do anything. He said, worth a risk. Let's move. Uh, okay. I guess we're following this guy. Oh, wait, 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 wait. We came here for supplies. He said, I got it out my bunker. Plus, I just took everything. You won't find anything. Okay, that's true. Uh, two zombies. He said, I'll take on the left. All right, I got right. Get him! Ah, these stupid zombies. Not gonna lie, no better feeling than ending one of those suckers. He said, piece of cake. Now you know why I'm out here all alone. <laughs> They're easy. Yeah, true. All right, let's roll. Oh, and that's his car? Uh, we'll take ours. Good to have two just in case. Uh, this is interesting, bro. And no, he has a white van. That's interesting. And Ken just said, you sure we can trust him though? He can betray us any time or lie about being bitten. I'm gonna say, look, it's two versus one. If anything, we just defend ourselves. We'll be fine. Gosh, man, I hate seeing how torn up the city is. It's so sad. But anyways, where's this guy's bunker at? And oh, is that it over there? Hold on, if that's his bunker, he wasn't lying. This guy's geared up. Oh my goodness. And okay, we're going to this side of his bunker. Oh my goodness. This is like a zombie apocalypse machine. Wow. Nice spot you got here. I know. Oh, okay. I'm gonna say, well, do you have an inside? Not gonna lie, a little dangerous. There's no roof, it seems as though. And whoa, 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 what's that? Whoa, he does have an inside. This thing is nice. Storage, hospital beds in case you want to sleep. Wow. Hey, uh, Derek, I appreciate you taking us in, man. I think we'll be a better team together. And he said, no worries. Wow, this is nice. I'm going to say, well, do you have any updates on the total infected count? Is it getting any better? And he said, well, I do know something, uh, which is, what does this guy know? I'm kind of confused now. He said, there is a scientist working on a cure. And he 
he's halfway done. Interesting. Yeah, that's very good. And where's he located? He said, we can go and check if he needs something. And we can get it since he's all alone. All right, that's fine with me. He said, I'll take you to the man. All right, uh, let's roll in my car. Save fuel. All right, this is looking promising, boys. Someone's finding a cure to this zombie stuff, finally. I mean, maybe we won't have to die like this. And maybe he won't be like this forever. Not gonna lie, though. I love that guy's setup, though. That house is sick. Perfect for a zombie apocalypse. I'm gonna say, Derek, where to? He said, continue. Uh, all right. We're going to the city, it seems, though. I don't like jumping to the city. It's where all the zombies are. Everyone gets infected and such. Uh, straight still? He said, right. Okay. Turning right. Oh, my goodness, man. It's so sad seeing Brookhaven like this. There's no reason why I should be like this. It's just a ghost town. And he said, left. Okay. Right. Okay. And, oh, I think I see it. He just said that. And, whoa, he barricaded off the road. This guy's smart. He said, leave the car here. He said, he might shoot, so stay here. Uh, all right, I guess we'll wait here. Ken, this is looking good. He said, yup, we might find a cure. Bro, if, if there's a doctor working on a cure, we could actually end this. Like, we don't have to die in a zombie apocalypse. And oh, look, he's talking to him. He said, I got visitors. Is it zombies? And he said, nope, survivors. And he said, okay, good. All right, so you can come. All right, let's go. Wow, look at this house. It's all barricaded up. <gasps> wait, Dr. Zira. He said, hey, guys. Oh, I saw this guy before in the city. I'm going to say, I remember you. You were picking up guns. And to the grocery store, too. He said, yeah. Oh, okay. It's that guy. I'm going to say, so? I heard you're working on some kind of cure. Is that true? He said, yeah. I'm pretty near the end of it. Oh, uh, can we see it? He said, I'm just missing a few things. He said, yeah, come inside. Okay, perfect. Wow, bro. I'm not going to lie. It feels good to actually know we're not alone in this. Like, I won't lie. I thought everybody was infected. All we did the first day was sit inside. So I guess I had no clue. But wow, look at this. This guy's like growing all sorts of plants and stuff. I guess this is part of the stuff using the cure. And he said, over here. Uh, careful of the water. Alrighty. Uh, we're back in here. All these boxes. Uh, that's interesting. <gasps> and whoa, look at this. It's a lab. Plant quantum theory. Wait, what are you talking about? Oh, right there is a book. I don't know what that is. He said, this is where I spent a lot of my time. I'm going to say, makes sense. He said, oh, I read that before I go to sleep. Ha ha. Uh, okay. I don't know what that's about. It's a very good book for learning about plants. Uh, all right. Anyways, where's the cure? <laughs> and even Derek said, Dr. Zira, we're here for the cure. He said, oh yes, my bad. <laughs> I just love my plants. Bro, who is this guy? Is he even really a doctor? He just named himself that. He said, it's in this box. Oh, uh, it looks empty right now. He said, in my hand is the start of it. Oh, some sort of pills. Interesting. He said, but I still need more stuff like I said. I'm gonna say, so your plan is to get pills and then give them to zombies? I'm gonna say, Sorry, sir, but what kind of zombie is gonna swallow a pill? Sounds kind of stupid. And Derek said, not a pill. Looks like it to me. I'm gonna say, what is it then? He said, you shoot it with a gun. Oh, it's something you can add to a dart. Oh, yeah. Ken said like a dart bullet. Okay, that makes more sense then. All right, that's looking a bit more promising. I'm going to say, well, what else do you need for it? He said, I'm not exactly sure what I need at the moment. Oh, that's not good. I'm still trying to learn what this all is. Okay, it takes a lot of testing. I'm going to say, well, if you don't mind me asking, do you know where this zombie virus even came from? He said, it started from the military. Something about making a virus to take over other places. Sadly, it became an outbreak. Yeah, I know. And not gonna lie, I was one of the first people to see it as well. He said, I found the files for it, so I've been trying to learn more about it. He said, due to me finding the files, I can find a way to kill it. Oh, okay. That makes more sense. He said, like I said, it takes time. I'm gonna say, well, Dr. Zira, I'm glad we're all together. If you need anything, just let me know, and we're on it. He said, oh, well, he will need. <laughs> Why do you think we came here? He said, okay, I'll let you know what resources I need once I learn what it is. Just give me a moment while I learn more about this. Um, all right. He said, you can all head upstairs if you wish. Uh, sounds good. But wow, this is getting weirder and weirder. Well, like I said, I'm very glad we found something and someone. And where's Derek? Ken said, this is amazing. I'm gonna say, yes, I, I know. It is looking very good. If he creates that cure, we'll end this zombie apocalypse. And he said, yup. Uh, anyways, I'm getting tired. Uh, I think I fell asleep. And what the? Tap, tap, wake up. Tap, wake up. Uh, 
uh okay well what's up look outside what's outside uh what the heck there's three zombies and what locked the door what are those things and what's that big one and uh okay there's one of the roof bro what the heck and they're screaming at us they just said rah uh doc come check this out dude i don't know if you're gonna like this he said what's going on uh zombies is what's going on and bro why does that one all muscular and have horns it's so weird he said oh my this is not good i'm gonna say what's not good why does that one have horns i don't get that he said i didn't think they would make it this far what are you saying guys what huh explain he said the one with horns may be a leader or perhaps mutated meaning this is worse than i thought he said it could have special abilities like maybe strength or maybe fire invincibility oh okay interesting he said sadly there's no way of finding out though i'm gonna say well let's get these zombies everyone get back everyone get back roof is closed this is the only way all right that's fine oh gosh it fell in the water i'm gonna say look i'll open the door you guys shoot okay here we go oh gosh the door's right there and three two one unlock oh Get that sucker! Oh, that one's hiding behind the door still. Is he smart? Why is he hiding? Uh, he's coming in, he's coming in! Get him! Oh my goodness! Why is he not getting hit? And he's like running around in circles. What's this one's problem? Hold on. Uh, he seems bulletproof. All right, lock it up, lock it up. Bro, what in the world? He said, well, this is a problem. I'm going to say that zombie doesn't die. It's immune to bullets. Yeah, that's really weird. I'm going to say, look, let's just leave it, okay? I'll patch up the door right now. I'm going to say, grab this zombie's body. Uh, let's just stay inside. We'll be safe here for now. And Ken said, yeah, hopefully. Let's move underground as well. Yeah, that way the they'll probably leave us alone. Oh my goodness, bro. This is getting worse and worse. I'm kind of losing hope a little bit, but no, it'll be fine. He said, well, I suppose it's good we got a zombie. It could help with the cure. I'm gonna say, good to hear, doctor. Hopefully we find something soon, guys. I'm getting kind of worried, not gonna lie. 